Hi friends, this is Naresh. Welcome back to my channel, Technical Talks with Naresh. So today I am going to prepare a video on Workflow Process in Oracle Fusion Part 3. Okay, and here we are going to see the how to bypass the workflow of roles. So in my last two videos, I had gone through the other requirements of a workflow and this video we are going to learn that how to bypass the workflow of roles. Okay, so before starting just I have to say that if you are new on my channel and if you want to learn the Oracle Fusion, I had a separate playlist for an Oracle Fusion on my channel. Please go through it. If you have any doubts, any question, you can just write into the comment section or you can just reach out to me by the email which is mentioned in the description section of my channel. So continue to the topic. In my last video, I just told you that the workflow processes and its approval. But now if you want to bypass that approval process, so you don't want to send any type of workflow for an approval. So how can we do that? Okay. So for seeing this, we have to just go to our Oracle Fusion instance first. So this is the home page of my Oracle Fusion instance. So here what we have to do, we have to check the how to bypass the workflow processes. So I already told the navigation in my last video, but if you are new on the channel, for them I am just telling, so click on this navigator icon, then after go to tools. So here is an tools, just expand this tools and there is an option transaction console. So click on this transaction console. So it will load you one another page. So here you can see a lot of the workflow details. Okay, so I am just removing the filter first and going here the approval rules. So as we seen in the last video. There are a lot of workflow rules in this approval rule. We can specify the approval hierarchy for any of the respective workflow. So I'm just writing here the create job workflow. Okay, so create job. Then after I'm just clicking on the search icon and this is my create job workflow. So I already having some workflow hierarchy for this approval. So if I click on this configure rule, so I can see that respective hierarchy. So you can see that this is my approval rules okay so if i click on this user and if you come down so you can see here there are two approvals okay first one is a development user and second one is a user triple a okay now these are the two approvals but after creating the job i don't want to send it further any type of an approval so what we can do i'm just cancelling this one first just click on yes so we will come back on this page now here is an option that is a bypass approval just you have to click on this option so it will enable this box so you can see that this is now enabled that the checkbox is coming okay now it is saved okay now suppose i am just creating any type of job so it will not go for an any approval hierarchy okay so i will just try to create one job so i am just going to their setup and maintenance then here is a task icon i will click on the task and there is an option search so i will just click on this search button and here I will write the manage jobs and I will just click on search so it will come manage job just select the first one then here we have to create a new job so here is an option to create a new job just click on this button so it will come on this page so here you can just give the name and the code for the jobs so I'm just giving it as an bypass the approval process and then after I'm just writing the test as the keyword I'm copying the same into the code also and I'm just clicking on the next now here just you have to fill one detail so just select the job package as a no and just click on save once it is saved you can just click on the submit so I'm just clicking on submit so you will get this message just click on yes sir here so the request was submitted click on ok now last time we had seen after this writing here the job name it was not coming now i will try that okay so i am just writing here bypass and i will try to search so you can see my job is created and it is coming over here why it is created because we don't have the approval hierarchy in last video where we had there is an approval hierarchy of you know, two users, but here there is a no approval hierarchy, so it is automatically got created because we bypass the approvals. So this is how we can bypass the approval process of an any workflow. So in next video, we are just going to see the next.
कंडीशनल अप्रूवल ऑफ द वर्क फ्लो प्लीज लाइक शेयर सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग थैंक यू